Hi, Polly here with Cut It Home. Today I am going to make a quick scrapbook page with a new collection by Graphic 45. We had gone to a place called Living Treasures in Pennsylvania and they have animals that you can feed and I had some pictures of giraffes and zebras so I wanted to find the perfect paper to use for those pictures and I found them in this new collection. The collection is called Safari Adventure and they have a lot of nice pattern papers in the collection. They have tags, chipboard tags that you can use. In the 8x8 paper collection they have different pattern papers and the one thing I like about Graphic 45 is they have their double all double sided pages. A lot of animal prints. They also had a page in there that was um, an 8x8 eight 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 collection that had some little postcards that I'm using on my layout. Um, the back was just a pattern paper and they had these little postcards that you could use. I've cut them apart and I'm going to use a couple of them on my layout. And then they also have a 6x6 paper pack and it has a lot of different assorted prints and solids. You could even use these for the back of a scrapbook layout, the background. Just pick four that you like and you can put them you know, side by side on your layout to create a nice background if you want to use the different patterns or if you wanted to mix solids and patterns. Just a couple ideas of what you can do with the collection. They also have the 12 by 12 paper pack and this background page that I'm using is from that. And also what I did with um, one of the pages from the 8x8 eight eight pack is I wanted to make a border on the one side of my page and I wanted it to be this animal print so I cut the 8x8 eight eight page down to 6 inches and I lined up the patterns and used a piece of Angel Craft double sided tape to put that together and it's seamless you can't even tell that it's um, another piece of paper that I'm going to trim this and use this as a border on my page. So I just wanted to talk a little bit about that collection and tell you about it. It's be great for your summer pictures, animal pictures, any safari pictures or zoo pictures. It's a nice collection. Stop by at the Cut at Home blog and see my finished project. Until next time, thanks and happy scrapping.